Hey guys, welcome back to the channel once again. And this video is about the latest uh, update fixed with the Windows 10 2004 version. This is the latest update which has been rolled out uh, just a couple of months ago. And uh, if you know this, this includes many uh, errors and well-known issues that you might have faced so far. So we are just going to check for the additional updates if it has come and Microsoft is claiming to roll out the preview update as an ad additional optional update you can say. So this is 2020.07 cumulative update preview for Windows 10 2004 x64 based system. So if you're running on the 32 bit this is not for you guys and uh, after that this is going to merge the optional update with the Windows update uh, interface and after that make sure you restart but before that let me show you what are the details of this latest patch or you could see the optional update all right so we are going to type the key b a package name and then you can see the basic result it rolled out a couple of days ago it's not that so old so you can check out the update catalog uh, file including various files you can download them manually but i will recommend you always to download from the settings uh, update and security feature panel all right you can see the variety of the packages which works only over 1903 version or later okay all right so uh taking you to the official support page where you can see the actual uh well-known issues and uh, what kind of changes it's going to bring for your latest update so this is the july 31st 2020 kb4566 one os bill 9041 this is going to help you to merge with the latest 20 2004 update so this is just a preview it's all up to you if you want to install it you can install it or if you don't want to install it you might fix by yourself the well known issues you are welcome to do that but if you are not able to handle that i will always uh, recommend you to go through these kind of things because this is the thing you should do it with your system all right so here you can see the well known issues which has been a nightmare with the Microsoft products uh, uh, like uh, with the Microsoft Edge, SharePoint, Excel and so many other things with it, including printing issues and uh, that will be gone uh, if you install this update and uh, to get that you can see the thing we had the, done just a uh, few minutes ago inside optional updates available under the update and security and that's the thing you need to do all right so we are done with the uh, catalog preview i will give uh, the link uh, uh, in the description down below you can read out or you can just manual switch you are quite genius guys okay so here we are done with the update process or we just have to restart it now and uh, after this it is uh, going to uh, take a little bit of time it took around 10 minutes for me uh, running on ssd over uh, ifac processor and that's it okay so if i search once again under the updates let's see if we have any additional no we don't have and you can see the update history including our last uh, um, preview patch all right now i'm going to install uh uninstall the or you can say the just delete the garbage files including the a previous update inside this cleanup so you can see it's around 2.83 gb including in total 2.87 gb with the other files all right, so we are just going to delete them because that is kind of mess that you should always delete. So I would always uh, recommend you should uh, consider doing this, okay? So this is the must-do thing you should do. Again, it's all up to you. If you don't uh, want to delete, you want to roll back, that is going to help you, okay? All right, so this is how you can install optional update, which is given in this latest update. And that's it. Thanks for watching.